Thank you all for being here this afternoon. I wish I could figure out a way to give you all a great big group hug. It's just so great to see you here. The other, it seems endemic to the human experience. We fear the other, the one who looks different than we, the one who sounds different than we, the one who eats or worships or lives different than we. And all too often, that fear of the other hardens, hardens into hatred and racism. Why do we paint our toxic swastikas? What is wrong with us? Our religious traditions, in their finest moments, call us to acknowledge a great truth. We are all of one flesh. Yes. We are all children of God. We are all brothers and sisters in one human family. Amen. With all of our wondrous differences, we are the possessors of one shared humanity. If I am an alive, awake, interesting, and interested person, difference should intrigue me. Difference and diversity should be the spice of life, the origin of great questions and gripping answers. Amen. What? Amen. Why? <laughs> In the Walla Walla Valley, we wish to be a place where difference is valued, Amen. where diversity is neither threatening nor threatened, where we live with our differences and in our differences, where we learn about one another and from one another. In short, we wish to be a place that treasures the other. Yes. Yes. We are tired of racism. We are tired of ethnic cleansing. We are tired of talk of a master race. We are weary of these in our history we will not abide them in this time or this place. Perhaps you saw or read the story that broke this week about Pavel and Ola, a young neo-Nazi couple in Poland, combating the other, in this case, rabidly anti-Semitic, until Ola recalls a childhood conversation with her parents, until a little research, until the discovery that both she and her skinhead neo-Nazi husband are Jewish. <laughs> Pavel goes to the rabbi in Poland and says, they're telling me I'm Jewish, help me because I'm going to lose my mind. And so it is that Pavel and Ola begin the challenge of embracing a heritage they once despised. It sounds like an exotic tale, but it is not. For every time we condemn the other, the tapes of a conversation with our divine parent should play, calling us to acknowledge our shared humanity, our joint heritage, our unity amidst diversity. To that end, May God help us. Yes. Amen. Amen.